I want to talk a little more about that hoodie, too, because in the comic book, people may, may remember, you know, uh, Luke Cage has his tiara, yeah. he has his gold shirt, mm -hmm. he's got this big belt. You're not rocking any of that stuff here, uh, except for one scene we kind of make a reference, to, sort of yeah. a homage to that, uh -huh. homage to that. Yeah. Um, tell me a bit about the, the fashion choices you made for the show. Were you in on deciding what the character should wear? Yeah, sure. I think the first discussion we had, Chael and I, we talked about use of the N-word, we talked about hoodies, we talked about music, and we talked about, you know, just the tone of the show overall. And the hoodie came up because, you know, it made sense. It was more appropriate for the time. Yo, I don't like your tone. Excuse me? You're being disrespectful. It's unnecessary. <laughs> Yo, Amos. What up? Show the man what you famous for. It made sense because it actually is it is an effective disguise in a, in, a, in a way without trying to be overtly, you know, you know, um, drawing attention to yourself. You and know, a tiara is not a good disguise. You think it draws a little too much attention. Yeah. You know, we want to be um, somewhat, you know, somewhat hidden yet not call attention to it. The hoodie is easy. You put it down. You put it up. And at the same time, it's something that's very comfortable and practical. People wear it all the time. You know, the fact that it's been associated with uh, the Black Lives Matter is because of Trayvon Martin because of the, the senseless, um, you know, reasoning behind pointing out black males who wear this as if they're wearing it to rob banks every time they're putting it on. It just, it's, it's, it's unbelievable that they can't wear the hoodie for what it's actually, you know, worn for, which is just to be comfortable. Um, it's a sad state of affairs. I remember growing up in, uh, in South Carolina years ago, and I didn't wear it because my mother and I talked about it, and it was something that was, I was conscious of. Um, after the Trayvon Martin incident, I really, uh, it angered me, and I, and I thought to myself, I said, this is really ridiculous that I have to consciously think about it this kind of stuff. And for me, it was sort of a stance. Then I went out and bought several hoodies. So I felt like this show was a chance to, you know, bring attention to that and just kind of make sure that people knew that sometimes heroes can wear hoodies as well.